What is up you sexy YouTube mother lovers? Today, I'm gonna suffer. So we have Will from Forge Relations here up, and we're gonna be doing, basically, if you've seen uh, a certain YouTube show called Hot Ones, they have a variety of hot sauces that, uh, I guess they range from not so comfortable Correct. to Six fatality. Six million Scoville units. Six million. Six million. Six million. I'm not good at math. Like, uh, give me so a. Six million's a lot. So that okay. would be like taking ghost peppers and just shoving a whole pile in your mouth. Awesome. Yeah. I would love to do that. And then lighting it on a fire, though. So, you know. Still, I'm take down. That consideration. You told me before that you actually don't like hot stuff. So, uh, <laughs> although my name is Herrera, I am a terrible, terrible Hispanic. I have no resistance whatsoever, built in or otherwise, to hot foods. So I'm probably going to be. Probably gonna be puking uh, by number five. And yes, we do have a hot range behind us. We are here at the JMAC Customs SMS 2020. So a little different today, we're gonna to be using chips for each little uh, sauce we're going to instead of wings. So uh, we're gonna start with number one. I'm gonna pass that to you. If you're unfamiliar with the format, he's gonna be asking me some questions, a lot of which you guys have sent in via Instagram. Thank you very much. And uh, I'm gonna to attempt to answer them. All right, Chad, how much of a pour? You got one. a fucking solid pour. I did. Pour. It kinda, yeah, be careful with that one. It just kind of dripped right out. Oh, oh so Jesus. Like, there you go. Yep. Yeah, yeah, you okay. Go. Let a little bit. Let the fun out. So let's take a little bite and enjoy. Right. To misery. To misery. <laughs> okay, so what was the first gun you ever owned? I actually did a video with that not too long ago. Uh, it was a Mossberg 500 pump shotgun. So, really? Nothing fancy. Okay. Although Did you that modify it? Uh, I had the pistol grip on it because nice. I wanted to. I, I just seen Zombieland and I thought mm -hmm. that that was uh, that was the coolest thing ever. Wasn't bad, right? No, that was actually. Uh, I would almost say pleasant. That would be like going to um, you know a Mexican restaurant and asking for mild salsa. Maybe okay. I don't. I think it's even below that. I was wondering, like yeah. maybe I'm better at this than I thought. That wasn't bad. Well, you know, we haven't really started yet, but we are going to go on to number two, which is uh, pineapple. You like pineapple? Uh, yes, okay. and I dare I say it belongs on pizza. I like the pineapple. That's good, right? That's fruity. Yeah. So, out of all the guns in the world, what got you into AKs? So, that was actually the first gun I ever shot. Is a lot of a lot of dads start their kids out on 22s and whatnot. I got a, uh, I think it was an underfolder. Yep. Really? 30 round How did that old. happen? How was that your first gun that you ever got? I think I was like eight years old. <laughs> and uh, eight and AK. Come on, son. <laughs> really? Yeah. Let her let her go. That's that's the America I remember. You know, it was one of those things where as a teenager, you know, I I just sit there, you know, 12, 13, I'd just tear it apart. You know, mm -hmm. I wasn't allowed to have ammunition or anything like mm -hmm. that, but I would just tear it apart, figure out how to put it back together. Uh, do it a million times and just got really comfortable with the platform and after a while that's really all you want to use. So the muscle memory is there, I can do it in my sleep. That's unbelievable because when we were at, with you building some, mm. they are the hardest guns to build. I mean, it's, I'm yeah. an AR guy and I'm like, put this over here, put this in there, yeah. you know, it's great. I'm watching you, I'm like, wait a minute, we actually have to do something? It's like, what are the power tools building. for? Yeah, I didn't know, presses and this, and this, it's no joke. Oh yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's definitely more of an art than a science, Yeah, for sure. There you go. Let's see. Cause so far, I'm 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 very pleasantly surprised. This Good. is not bad. Let's see how long you're saying that for. Mm. Decent little bit there. Cheers. Cheers. That really wasn't bad. No. I say let's go hotter. Let's go hotter. Let's go hotter. This. Yeah. Let's just go ahead. Okay. We only have so many questions. Let's just go. Okay, let's perfect. bump this right up to four. Okay, Joe. Perfect. So we're skipping a question. Cruising like right this. along. Perfect. So we're going on four. I feel like so we this need to get. Is... I need to get. So if, if cursed gun images has taught me anything, mm -hmm. you guys love to see me in fucking pain. So uh, let's let's bump this up. Okay. I like that. I like your style. I may not in about five minutes. It's getting a little thicker. So the thing with hot uh -huh. sauces too, the thicker they get, you know, the more the more dangerous they're going to become. So it's kind of like napalm. Absolutely. You know, yes. Jellies Great it up. Comparison. And, oh, that is getting a little mm -hmm. dummy thick. <laughs> there it is. <clears throat> uh -huh. That's still not terrible. No, but the peach was nice. It was like, you know, 
It was enjoyable, but then yeah. it hit you. It's, it's hot. <clears throat> getting, getting there. Want to go one more level up before let's go we go one more? Up. Let's go five. Okay. Let's five. go five and like then we'll go for a question. Perfect. I like it. It's a good question coming up. All right. It's probably one of you guys' questions. Actually, it's a good question, so it probably wasn't. Do you like chocolate? Um, I may not in about 60 seconds. I'll get a little bit more on there. Yeah, yeah. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. You asshole. Uh, <laughs> mm -mm. Very flavorful. Mm. I got it on my lips. Mm. You're in <laughs> trouble now. Mm -hmm. And that's why we didn't do wings, because it is so hot outside. We didn't want wing sauce all over right. us with 6 million Scoville units. So if you guys are going to call us out for eating chips, anyway, look at it. It's still super hot. What was the question? Okay. So <laughs> what made you start on YouTube? I mean, what was the reason behind, you know, finding that platform and going with it? So I've been on YouTube for about 12 years now, roughly, I think. Um, started with just, you know, little airsoft stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah. Wow. I was having, I was channels in, in high school, whatever. And uh, just doing airsoft content, whatever. Just being in front of a camera. Fuck this is getting, getting up there. Trying to focus. Um, but yeah, what actually started me on um, on the, the AK guy channel is uh, I think I started that one like five years ago. And uh, I just had some videos that I wanted to put up just so I could share with friends or put on forums or whatever. And so I just started a channel and literally was in uh, my fucking college earth science class under the table creating the account like, well, what, what should the username be? Well, all my friends call me the AK guy because I'm obsessed with AKs. So yeah, whatever, the AK guy. And then it stuck. And so it's like, that, that's how it all started. And we took it seriously like two or three years ago, trying to, you know, get with the algorithm. And mm. <laughs> I shouldn't have got it on the lip. <laughs> trying to find the, the sweet spot in the algorithm and it's really taken off. And for that, we are very grateful. All right, so I think it's time to move to six, which is a uh, Southern Redneck. I'm getting what do you a think? false. What do you think? That looks good. Looks good. False sense of, uh, of cockiness here. So let's just. It's gonna bite me in the ass, but let's go for it. I had had this one before, so oh, that's oh, it's thick. Oh shit, it was a lot. Mm. Oh, that was about what you had. If I can eat a fucking chip. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. That is a southern redneck for you. This is hot, buddy. Uh huh. <clears throat> Which brings me over. Actually, no way does that segue at all, but the sponsor of this video. <laughs> oh, man, that's in my sinuses now. The sponsor of this video, which we're very grateful for, is Young Americans for Liberty. And now I'm going to attempt to do the ad bit. Young Americans for Liberty is hiring full-time campaign staff to elect pro-liberty candidates. Join the other like-minded liberty activists from September 19th to November 3rd. I know it's a long time, but let's face it, you're not doing anything else. Pay is $3,700. Holy fuck. <laughs> it's like the longer your tongue is out in the air, the worse it is. Mm -hmm. I shouldn't be talking. What's awesome is that Young Americans for Liberty actually told me that you guys over 150 of you guys have already signed up to work with YAL under this program, which is Operation Win at the Door, which is really cool because it means you guys are putting your money where your mouth is. I can do it. Housing is provided and gas is totally covered while you're on the campaign. If you want to step up and take action in this insane political environment and actually protect our Second Amendment rights, you can go ahead and click at the link below. You can sign up through the link in the description and in the pinned comment below. The link is yaliberty.org slash akguy. Go ahead, click it. Why not? Again, we want to thank YAL. They're a fantastic sponsor, and it actually gives you guys a meaningful way to help protect the Second Amendment. I'll have a water now. Oh, that helps, doesn't that it? Does that does so much. Yeah. Let's do number seven. All right. Oof. Ooh, no. Ooh. That, okay, that, that looks good, right? Because right now, I think I could walk away from this in like 30 minutes, I'll be totally fine. Like it never happens. Yeah, we're... It's going away. Yeah. Come on, motherfucker. You're not kidding, this is thick. No, it's thick, yeah. There we go. Oh, there you go. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, that one hit. 
not so bad for me. Really? Mm, no, really? no, actually. Because I don't think you. It hits at a very interesting time. Do we have a question for this one? Yeah, we do. So, <laughs> what was one of your most memorable moments? Assholes shooting at a live range. What was one of your most memorable moments filming on YouTube or a video that you really are proud of? So definitely the first time we got the AK-50 to work. That was awesome. That was, uh, I actually came and hung out with you guys afterward that mm -hmm. night. That was, that was a lot of fun. Mm -hmm. That one's a big one. Uh, the Kit Cope fight where my completely untrained ass got in a ring with, uh, I think it was, he's Muay Thai champion of the world several times mm -hmm. over Kit Cope and he uh, beat me up and choked me out. That was fun. That was fun. He's a great I enjoyed dude. watching that, yeah, that was cool. He's a great dude, and I'm glad he didn't mm -hmm. kill me because he definitely could have. And then this, I think later on, this is gonna get up there too. You're this is at watch, least gonna be memorable. watching this back. Yeah, will I? Oh yeah, 100%. Yeah, yeah. sweaty fucking mm -hmm. snot dripping out my nose, blood coming out of my eyes, yeah. We are getting there. We're getting there. We're on number eight. So for someone that wants to start a YouTube channel, what kind of advice would you give a newbie out there? Mm. Definitely don't focus too much on equipment. Lighting is good, you know, uh, having a, a you know, decent audio is pretty good, but I mean, most smartphones now are more than capable of, of, of doing a, a more, than, more than capable of doing a YouTube worthy quality. Definitely, uh, if you want to start, just get started because the longer you wait, the longer it's been since you should have started. It's amazing doing this with gunfire behind us. Yeah. It kind of takes away from the heat, but it really doesn't. It's no. still there and it's not going away. I'm just thinking about how, because of audio, they're prolonging my suffering. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. <clears throat> this still isn't terrible though. No. Well, now this is number nine. So now we're getting serious. This All right. is three, three million Scoville units. How you holding up, buddy? You doing I'm right? good. I'm okay. All right. I'm okay. All right. Oh, that, oh no, no way. Oh. Definitely, definitely pouring oh. some of that off. Yeah. No, I wouldn't yeah, want no you to way. do all that. It's oh, been nice no knowing way. you, buddy. What is this now? Three million? Three you million. Said? We're at three million. Fuck me. All right. Cheers. <laughs> I love it. What a life, bud. Cheers. All right. What? <clears throat> I lick my lips. Fuck. Yeah, you're in trouble. <laughs> what? What is your favorite variance of the AK? Woo, boy. Now we're getting there. Yep. I really love the crank. I love my crank to death. Oh, water. <sighs> Man. Water is not helping. No. no. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. The, uh, I like the AK-105s. I think it's perfect gas system length. You're not helping. They're not. <laughs> this is amazing, by the way. We're filming the hot ones on a set of uh -huh. fucking heat. You done, John Wick? <clears throat> the 105, I like the 545 a lot. I think everybody's first AK should be a 762, but I love 545. That was my next question. What kind of advice would you you know, give someone that, it, what's their first one? What would you, you know, should you build it or should you buy it? Definitely, if it's your first one, you uh -huh. should you should buy. You should buy it. Are but there it, any good, reputable people out there that you go to that uh, you can think of to get parts from that would you know buy their stuff? <laughs> I promise I will answer you. I don't take your time. So, I'm not in any rush. The American market is way better than it used to be. Uh huh. When does this stop? <laughs> It, it really doesn't, man. I'm telling you I right now. I can't exhale. I can't talk. I know. I know. <laughs> used to be American-made shit was just absolutely awful. Right. A lot of cast trunnions, bad headspace, bad build quality, bad parts. It's getting better, but still imports. Okay. But so definitely just buy one that's already done. Don't even try and attempt to build it yourself for your first time. I mean, you can. Okay. You definitely can, but it's, uh, I would, I, it's probably easier to ease into it. And then if you're going to build it, Definitely get with a reputable builder. 
and I hear somebody. you build them. Is this correct? According to some. Okay. <laughs> and they are for sale, correct? Yeah, so we've got a, actually a couple different variants that we're going to have uh, released in batches soon that are already built up, ready to go. Okay. Going to be in stock. Feels good. And I really want to smile while I say that. This is really hard. I'm very proud of that. I, I mean, am. I'm, very, I'm just I'm dying. Like, not only are you a YouTube celebrity, but you're also a manufacturer. You build guns. I mean, that's an, that's, that is an incredible feat. Oh, boy. Oh, you know, you know. <clears throat> All right. Oh! Touch ah! your face. Where's your, where's your, I put napkins in your pocket. Yeah. <laughs> I just touched my eyeballs. Oh, it's okay. You're okay. All right. All right. You oh. ready for this? Hold on. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to talk about the last sauce that we have, which is called the end, which is perfect because this it's is the, the end, end of this. Brandon, this is six million, six million Scoville units. And uh, this one I don't like. My head's hurting right now. Yeah. You got this, buddy. Hold on. <clears throat> I'm good now. You good? All right, here good. Go. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, it's pussy shit. You oh. need more. Oh, okay. No, I'm kidding. I, I, no, 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 you. Actually, it's been nice knowing you. Oh, this is so chunky. So I'm really hoping like, come on, that like Latino blood is gonna kick uh -huh. in at any moment, whatever's in there, just kind of like like Deadpool, like you put it in such an extreme situation that it just unlocks the genes. I think you got this 100%. I mean, there's only one way to find out, right? We will see. So this one's different because we have a challenge at the end. Because after do. this, we're gonna have to race down to the firing line. Uh -huh. After I answer the question, uh -huh. race down the firing line. And while we're essentially maced on six million Scovilles, uh, shoot mag dump two AKs that are sitting on the ground and hope to God we can see. Absolutely. You ready? To six million. To six million. Cheers. So, oh, I'm sure you get this question a lot. If you're new, how do you get into the gun space? I mean, I'm Fuck me, there it was. All the time. Sorry. No, no, it's okay because, you know, I'm glad I asked the question really quick because now it's your turn to answer. I'm going to let you do that right now. So there's all sorts of great options. Um, of course, SDI is a sponsor if you want to go the online uh, schooling route to get that base knowledge. Um, I suggest really interning. Intern with a reputable gunsmith. Right. Sweep the floors, do it totally for free, whatever it takes. Uh -huh. You'll learn more there Yeah. than you will a lot of gunsmith schools. <laughs> Practical knowledge, how to actually do it. Uh, so that's something um, that they should go do. Uh, yes, it is. Yep. You want to go shoot guns? Yeah, let's do, <coughs> let's uh, go do it. Wait, hey, do you want milk? Or, oh, no, no, no. We no, can't touch do it. it. Yeah, okay, we got to do the guns first. Perfect. Wait, you got ear protection? Eye protection? Well, yep, over here. We don't need, we don't need ears, right? Uh, yeah. We don't breath. need ears. Okay. Fuck. Ah. You know, the fact that we haven't touched almond milk yet <coughs> is amazing. Mm-hmm. I, it certainly feels amazing. Yep. Uh. <coughs> you know, it's funny when you swallow, it's getting progressive. Oh, uh, yeah. I figured that one out. It's not really going anywhere either. No, it's chilling. I think it's actually getting worse. <coughs> Preference? Pick your poison. No, I don't care. I'll let you. I'll All tell right. you, this is uh. one hell of a challenge. Yep. Oh, I, I can still kind of see. Oh, that's this hot one. Okay. Wait. No, wait. No. Middle. Yeah. No. There you go. Fuck me. Wow, this is wild, buddy. Ah, uh, yep. This is Three on you. Ready ride the lightning? Yeah, it's on you. All right. Three, two, one. So clear, we are good. Hey, oh. give me a high five over here. Oh, I didn't mean to leave you hanging. That's okay. You want oh. some almond milk? Yes. Yeah. Ah. Oh, it's getting so much worse. Oh. Nothing has gotten better. Ah. Fuck. Oh, dude. 
it tingles. Ah. Ah. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. We genuinely appreciate it. Be sure to check these guys out. I'll leave the links in the description. And I will see you sexy YouTube mother lovers in the next video. Yeah, why'd you do that? Why'd you do that? For the end bit. Dude, no. I'm actually not, I'm really not bad. No, it's really not that bad. Oh, good acting, man. Well, your face is so red. No, it's, I mean, it's bad, it's horrendous, but. It's actually not the milk, bad? The milk made it so much better. Because when we were down there, while we were shooting, it was the mouths wide open, mm -hmm. talking shit. That's happening when you breathe, again. When you breathe, it it's works. the air. The air is really bad. Like when you're out in the air. Mm-hmm. I am. Really? Did you spit that, that out or is it still in your mouth? No. I'm good. You like uh, swallowed well, it? Well, I sw no, I, I chewed it, swallowed it. There it is. You're fucking insane. Fuel is my obsession to make the perfect weapon like us put his eyes to the top. But I can't let you can stop, can stop, can stop, can stop, can stop, can stop. Some of the behind the scenes, so how are you feeling? I feel like I should have said no. <laughs> I uh, I forgot, you know, this is usually one of our favorite events of the year, hanging out with friends, going, doing questionable things while we're intoxicated later, and I probably won't be able to enjoy any of that because I'm going to be shitting out of my mouth.